hey guys welcome back to the wars and transfer episode on today's episode we are going to be diving in deep and looking and breaking down the mdatsane to cape town city transfer but before we get into the transfer guys i'd really like to welcome a few comments made by the community from the last video tindo said mdatsane is playing for cape town city now these were comments that you guys made in my previous video. Um, another comment from Felix was that Mdatsane is rumored to be joining Cape Town City. How is that true, Nkati? Another great comment um, from the community. I really appreciate this. And um, our last comment was from Dubeni. Um, it is true because I've heard that Mdatsane is at Cape Town City. Guys, I really like the comments, so I would appreciate you guys and I'll keep featuring more of your comments. But let's get into the um, transfer. Kaiser Chiefs target joins Cape Town City. The creative player who led Bahara to the 2018 Telecom Knockout Triumph has found a new home in the mother city. Cape Town City have announced the signing of former Baroka FC midfielder and captain Mdatsane. The attacking midfielder was recently released by Bahaha ahead of the general transfer window, which will open next week. The citizens who snapped up Mdatsane as they prepare for the second round of the 2019-2020 PSL season. The former um, Baroka captain was heavily linked with Kaiser Chiefs but explained his decisions um, to sign with Cape Town City. Mdatsane, who was released from his contract from Bahaha earlier this month, had a lot of reports really going around the league that the 25 year old could move to Kaiser Chiefs. Um, but all of this didn't come to fruition. This is what the player had to say about his deal at Cape Town City and regarding the rumors. They, Cape Town City, saw a chance and they utilized it. Um, I've signed a three and a half year deal. It's a great team. They showed interest in me. Unlike others, it was all rumors. I don't know anything about Kaiser Chiefs. It was just a rumor. It's like all talk, no action, no call, not even one call. The only team that called was Cape Town City and we reached an agreement. I just want to play football. It doesn't matter what's happening as long as I'm playing football. I got the opportunity and I grabbed it. Mdatsane could make his debut for the Mother City team on Sunday on the 5th of January. Cape Town City were delighted to announce the signing of the 25-year-old South African midfielder whose contract ends in 2023 in June. With a statement reading on their website saying, Welcome Ndu, a club statement read. The 25-year-old has become the first signing for Jean Older in the January transfer window. Will more signings follow the South African midfield maestro at Cape Town City? Guys, please don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys um, in the next episode. Um, the January transfer window is here. Things are heating up. And I'll try and feature more of you guys, um, more of your comments, um, more of your suggestions. If you have any ideas, if you have any news um, that I might not pick up, please feel free to comment down um, in the comments below and I'll get back to you. I always try and reply to everyone, but um, without further ado, let's end the episode here and I'll see you guys in the next episode, guys. Please don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe and I'll see you then.